motorists in Tunisia have expressed concern over the latest increase in fuel price in the North African country. The fourth time in 2022, authorities also increased the price of cooking gas cylinder by more than 10% leaving businesses and consumers frustrated over the prevailing circumstances. According to the government, despite its subsidies to minimize the cost of oil and gas, the oil price hikes in the global market is worsening the situation. Let's have more details of that in this report. Over 2 million Tunisian motorists, especially taxi drivers, have expressed concern over the successive fuel price hikes including the latest increase this month. Consumers in the North African state are grappling with record high gas prices, but the surge is also hurting the economic activity in the country. It's unacceptable that the cost of fuel has increased eight times in a few years and continues to rise while taxi tariffs are stagnant. We are working to pay for fuel. The state must compensate by offering incentives and preferential tariffs for consumers. Authorities in Tunisia also raised the price of cooking gas cylinders by 14%, although the government said it was the first time it was increasing the price of cooking gas in 12 years. However, consumers and businesses alike have decried the hike in liquefied petroleum gas, which they say will impact on the cost of living. Cooking gas as well as the electricity are too expensive. It's costly to pay the energy bills, but we cannot live without energy. We need more government subsidy. Tunisian authorities say that the country's subsidy fund in the 2022 state budget has been allocated a total amount of 900 million dinars, or around $277 million, for the subsidy of hydrocarbons. The government has, however, opted for sharing the burden with the citizens instead of increasing the subsidy fund, which has been hampered by the country's economic struggles. And unfortunately, since the, the oil price is rocketing, is uh, reaching $107 uh, per barrel, so we, we have no choice but to increase the, the cost. Obviously, this cost is sealed to a value of 5%, 5%, so we cannot increase more than 5% per month. The subsidy fund cannot afford uh, this huge increase in, uh, in the volume of uh, subsidy. The Director General of Hydrocarbons at the Ministry of Industry, Mines and Energy added that gas bottles and cylinders are heavily subsidized in the North African country. The cost of a bottle of 30 k k kilogra 13 kilograms is basically costing, uh, real cost is about 42 dinars per bottle. And it's only sold at 7.7 .7 dinars, which means it's heavily subsidized. Uh, unfortunately, all the subsidy fund for 2022 has already been absorbed by the, uh, by the uh, LPG bottles. The Tunisian Company of Electricity and Gas has applied the new increase in natural gas and electricity prices at rates ranging between 12.2% and 16% for residential customers and 15% for industrial ones. Tunisia's energy balance deficit doubled to around $1.9 billion in the first eight months of 2022, compared with almost $900 million last year, driven by the impact of the conflict in Ukraine. Energy analysts say that the purchasing power of all households will decline as fuel, LPG and electricity prices increase.